Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to see all about broadcast variable. Broadcast variable is mainly used to improve the performance in Spark. It avoids data shuffle and reduces the network I/O operations. Broadcast variable is a read-only variable that are cached and available in all the nodes in the cluster. Broadcast variable is mainly used in the joining conditions when one of the tables is small. The small table is cached in all the nodes. The small table is sent to the worker nodes through the driver. Spark works in master slave architecture. There will be one master node and the data will be partitioned across multiple worker nodes. Let's take an example of this data sets. We have a small data set and a large data set. The large data set has a reference to the small data set. M means married and s yes means single if we partition the large data set to multiple worker nodes and from each worker node if you reference the small data set that leads to lot of data shuffling which is an expensive operation in order to avoid that we can create a broadcast variable for this small data set by doing this the small data set will be copied to all the worker nodes and thereby we can avoid the data shuffling and reduce the network io operation let's see the practical implementation of the broadcast variable first let me import the spark session my spark session is up and running next let me initialize my two data set i have two data set one is status which is in map data type and my second data is a list of tuples let me run this now i am going to convert this status map variable as a broadcast variable so let me do that i am converting this map variable as a broadcast variable and storing this information in broadcast status variable so what spark does is it takes a copy of this data and place it in all the worker nodes Now I am going to create a data frame for the second data set. Let me run this. We created a data frame for the second data set, and we created a broadcast variable for the first data set, which is in the map format. Let me see if the my broadcast variable is created. I am just printing the value of m from this broadcast variable. let me run this i got the value now i am going to create a function to populate the value of this this broadcast variable and registering this function as a udf which is a user defined function and assigning this function to a variable called convert status now i am going to create a data frame with a new column status information where i am calling this user defined function and passing the key of the status while passing the key i'll be getting the corresponding value in the return statement let me run this here is a result with a corresponding value of this broadcast variable i hope you got a fair idea of what is a broadcast variable and its usage i hope you like this video thank you for watching